Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Nichelle and today we are going to be planning in my recollections uh, business planner and we are going to be continuing on with the Duchess kit from Little Miss Papery. So let me show you what all I have left, which is pretty much the whole kit. <laughs> um, I have a ton left over. So let me go ahead and just gather everything together and it may not be in any particular order so here we have the um, date covers i've already used one set in my um, a5 and then the glitter headers and then i have an additional set of glitter strips the uh, headers the full boxes and um, quarter boxes and then I have some more glitter strips left and some half boxes, a few pieces of deco. And then I have this whole sheet here, which is like the second sheet of the, um, I guess the two page kit along with washi strips. This is for the horizontal mat, by the way. All of the um, ombre heart check boxes and some littles, quite a few, excuse me, quite a few left. And then that first functional page. So um, the first thing that I'm going to do is because we have so much washi strips, I am going to lay those down in here. And I think what I want to do is that I am going to alternate between these and the um, glitter header. So I'm going to do that. And then I will be, uh, I will go ahead and just um, fast forward through that part for you because it does take me a little bit so Okay, so I am done with laying down the um, washi strips, and now I'm going to put in the uh, full boxes. So let me grab those. Okay, so I know that I want a quote box kind of in the middle, so I will use this one here. And then I did a little test, and um, these uh, there's going to be a slight gap, I believe. So we will see how that plays out. Hopefully, it's not a huge difference, to be honest. Okay, I think I want to do this. Um, And then I will go with a, I guess I'll kind of stick with the, the purple. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do the other side. And then I know I want to use this other uh, quote box in the middle. And why not use... And I'll use this one here. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and add the glitter headers like I normally do, and let me grab those. And because there's so much blue and purple going on, I think I decided, I, huh, let me see. Honestly, I'm not quite sure which one I want to go with. Um, Um, 
I'll go with this color. Okay. So we just got back from going to dinner to one of our favorite um, Mexican restaurants called Gringo's here in Texas. Haven't had it in a while, so it was nice to have. Been cooking a lot, which is always better. Save money. And I think I'm going to add another one down there, but I want to make sure all of these are covered up here first. Okay. Yeah, I like this. It kind of makes it pop on this side. It does blend on the other side, but that's okay. This is kind of like the only time I really use one glitter headers other than in my rewind spreads. I will I will use them in those as well. Okay, so now that we have our um, full boxes down, now I'm going to lay down our, just get um, right, get in the foundation of the, of the layout. I'm looking for, what am I looking for? What am I looking for? Okay. All right. So as you know, I post about three times a week, I mean three times a day. And so I am going to cut this in half. And if I can see this light here, this is kind of light. I'm hoping I can keep this even. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Okay. And let me go ahead and cut this as well, which I will have one left because I don't need four. Okay. And these are much skinnier, so, all right, let's roll, put this in, it's definitely much skinnier here, but that's okay. All right, so let's go ahead and lay these down. Okay, and then Friday. Which one did I leave off with? Uh, let me look back real quick. Okay, and then Saturday and Sunday, and I'll just go ahead and use another, I, I, I'm going to come back to that because I don't really do a whole lot of posting on Saturday and Sunday, maybe like once or twice, so I'm not sure what I want to do there. All right, let me add in now my checklist. I also, I try to, to do the opposite. Okay. Let's see. OK. 
Okay, I pulled this up accidentally. I'm gonna have so much of this kit left, it's unreal. Okay. Sorry about that, I'm cutting it and then trying to pull it up at the same time. Not being very cooperative. And then I have a half of a blue. I'll go ahead and use that there. Okay. Um, I think what I'm going to do is just go ahead and use the remaining of those um, smaller checklists. Be um... Actually, I don't. I really don't. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to use the print on this side. And then I will use the solid from here on the other side. I don't want to waste the checklist to be honest and I still have some to use in my personal spread like a lot okay all right so there we are we have everything down now I can go ahead and plan day to day or, or if we have anything going on day to day. So Monday I have my um, 31 minute call that I do like to track and that way it's a reminder for me. Sometimes I don't have the opportunity to go back, I mean to listen to it that night, but um, if I do then, you know, I have it. So let's see I think I'm gonna do the opposite color and since I have these TVs here I don't I mean not TVs but laptops I don't think I have any in this color so I'll use the dark I'll use the lighter one here no I better use this one all right so I have my 31 minute call on Monday and I'm gonna just bring it down here And then I have a um, leader call on Tuesday along with a um, webinar or training that I want to do. And let me grab a laptop for that. Um, actually, I'm going to use an alarm. No. Mm, I can't decide. Um, I'll use an alarm clock. Because I need to set my clock so I won't forget, to be honest. Okay, so there's that. And then... Um, I think I pushed back my webinar to this day. I think I have a, um, not a webinar, but a training. So I am going to use, I've used opposite colors. So I'll just use this one here. I think it's on this day. And then... On Friday, I'm having my wine tasting party, so I do want to mark that. And she doesn't have any wine glasses. So it is a party, so I'm going to mark this with balloons. And I've got some work to do for that. Okay, so let me go in and 
fill this in. Let me find a pen. Okay, so I have wine tasting. And then I have a um, And then I have a leader call. And then Pinterest training, which I really want to make sure I'm on for that. And then Wednesday, I said it was my opportunity event. Okay, so that's done. Now I want to go in and maybe add that piece of deco down there. Y'all have like no idea how much stuff I have left. This is why I don't purchase big kits. Okay. And then I think I'm going to add this last piece of deco on the end here on this side to kind of balance it out. All right. So I think I am... I think I'm done. I think so. All right, so let me quickly show you what I have left. Uh, I have half boxes. I have one more full box here and, and a ton of quarters. I still have this sheet right here. Glitter headers. And then ombre heart boxes, littles, and I keep hitting the, my camera, and then the, the functional page, date covers, and then I have the um, headers. So I still have quite a bit left, as you can see. Um, I won't even put a dent in this with the uh, personal size, but I will have enough to do a um, another personal spread probably uh, maybe even a um, rewind spread but we will see about that so thank you guys so much for joining me as I plan my in my business in recollections business planner and if you're not subscribed hit that subscribe button so you can continue to follow and until next time I will see you in my next video talk to you soon bye